from his club. Dude, that would have been fucking awesome. That would have been great. Because then you could have had words with him, and they would have been public. Right. That would be great. I do... I, I've got to say, though, I, you're my friend. I love you, man. But what you did was stupid. Yeah, okay. I understand that now. All right. Well, I'm not going to fixate on it, but... What he did was unacceptable. What I did was stupid. No, what he did was in his own self-interest, which is what people will do always. That's like a law of nature. So it's all right. I'm not going to beat you up for it, but I hope you learn from it because I don't want it to happen again to you. It, I'm, it couldn't possibly happen again. Well, you mean you think... It's never happened before. Right. That doesn't work I that mean, way. I don't put things past people, but I mean, it's, it, most owners know how to handle themselves. ADHD. Yeah, um, you guys uh, who called a few minutes ago about Kevin. Yeah. Uh, I wanted to clarify, I'm not a fan. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, okay. So what That's are you? All. So what are you? Say again? So what are you if you're not a fan? Oh, I'm just a comedy fan. I see the the other guys. I see. Like, uh, Brian Van Der Vander- is pretty funny. Uh-huh. He uh, covered the show. See, Kevin? Mary Bird is awesome. Yeah. So like what what's happening what ha- what's what's happening here is there is a guy who is not a fan of Kevin but is a fan of everybody else. Isn't that nice? No, yeah, Sam Winters sucks. Okay, does Dan Winters suck? Sam? Sam Winters? No, I like Sam. Kevin likes Sam, so there are t- there are, there are two things that you disagree on with Kevin right there. You're saying stuff while I'm saying stuff. Try that again. Oh, sorry. Um. Yeah, I thought Sam was funny one time when he accidentally strangled himself with a microphone cord on stage while he was rolling around, and that was really funny. See? That's all. So the uh, that's all I got to say. All right, cool. I mean, I'll, still, I'll see when shows to see if, like, I'll get into it, but, like, I don't know. It was just my, my take of how I first saw it. Gotcha. All right, thanks, man. Have a good one. Peace. All right, anyway... No, I'm not Kevin's fan. Do you hear that, Kevin? That guy called in. I'm just in. a fan of the shows he does. That call. That guy called in to say that he doesn't. He's not actually a fan of. Yeah, yours. he wanted to clarify. Yeah. Apparently, you have a scarlet letter somewhere on your body. Haters gonna hate. Lovers gonna love. Oh, whatever. You... I don't even want none of the above. I'm going to piss on you. Yeah, whatever. Piss in your food. <sighs> All right, are you still on the butt plugs? I hope you aren't. No. All right, what what, what else do you have? Let's see here. Fucking a. Just wanted to clarify, I'm not a fan. Kevin, get over it. We don't care. Well, fuck you, man. Keep my balls. He'd love to, but he's not here, Kevin. And apparently he has other balls that he likes to eat. Right. And if he went to the show, he saw a fucking show for free, so eat my balls. He didn't. No, he I doubt he saw it for free. Yeah, he did see it for free, because nobody got the goddamn cover fee. Nobody oh. got the money. I thought the owner got the money. No. Nobody collected the money, as far as I know, at all. Oh. So all the money just fucking evaporated. This is gone. Okay. Stupid. Another promoter would have got my money. Okay. Which would you prefer? Sorry. Which would you prefer? (laughs) For another promoter to get your money or for no one to get it? I would have preferred people not to perform at all and leave. Sadly, that is something you can't do after you've already planned a show. Right. Well, I don't know about that. Well, okay. So if I was at one of their shows and they got kicked out, I would have walked with their asses. Okay. But that's with, just how I am. You, you just, also would have not given your money back. Um, what are you talking about now? So, okay, here's here's an imaginable situation, of, which I, I think is possible, right? What if you collect money at the door, okay? Uh-huh. Your guys start doing the show, and then the owner kicks one of your comedians off the stage mm-hmm. because of something he said or did on stage. 
That's true. Then we have to finish the show for the rest of the people. Oh, okay. So you wouldn't walk with them in but that situation. I promoted the show. I got everybody there. No contest. It's So it's living bullshit that they've kicked me out the door. I'm sorry. It's crap. It's their business. They can kick you out. Yeah, they can, apparently. So it's all right. I'm how out how many shows money. did you do at that venue? And it's fucking, I'm pissed. How many shows did you do at that venue? A lot. Like four months every week. Okay, four months every week, so, so 12. Okay, at least 12. Between 12 and 16, right? Depending upon the month. All right, so I mean, that's fine. Good, great, who cares? It's all right. I mean, he would not have kicked you out had you not told him this thing. Right. Well, it was stupid, but you know. It's all right. Don't get me wrong, I do plenty of stupid shit. Not usually in business. Oh my! Like mind you, but like I do plenty of stupid shit. You have watched me do plenty of stupid shit. Anyway, phones are up eight seven seven six four two five four eight three. That's eight seven seven NHB Live. NHB Live through AOL, Yahoo, and Skype. Call in, tell me I suck. Yeah, 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 yeah. If anyone else would like to uh, call Kevin and like. Tell him he, he's like, he sucks. I don't think you suck, Kevin. I just think you made an unwise decision and you paid the price. No reason to be mad about it. Well, it, but yeah, but the caller thinks I suck. Oh, well, he's allowed to. Oh, yeah, that's for sure. What, that's what happens when you, you put yourself out. This is true. For public display, people are allowed to have a public opinion of you. That's true. So you invited that, and that's all right. But he likes the people I book. Well, that's, Isn't that fucking nice? Well, that's all that matters. How many times have you collected his money? Exactly. So... And you owe me $5 for the last show. No, you don't, actually. <laughs> you, you don't at all, because that was Kevin's fault. Oh, y'all niggas owe me $5. They don't owe you anything. But that's okay. You can all line up. Yes, yes. Please line up. Give Kevin your money. Give me $5. Yeah, give Kevin $5. I seriously, this is the first time... i got another show Thursday. It's not really that big of a deal. But I, I'm wondering who's the asshole that wants to call me up and call me out on it. Like, well, you should have asked balls. him. Ask him. I bet he would have he, he would have told you he was. No, he didn't. I, it, was, it was being very stupid and sing-songy, and he did not tell us who he was. So let me teach you something about Facebook. And then he said he hates Sam. Well, fuck you too, dude. Let me teach you something about Facebook, Kevin. I have his phone number. So if you type that phone number in and it's a cell phone number, it's inexorably tied, unless you're me, to a Facebook phone number. Oh, right. Oh, that's what we do know who it is. Well, my point is, I don't think you deserve to know. Oh, really? Because it really doesn't matter. No, it doesn't matter. So practice what you preach and don't ask me for that phone number. Who cares? Well, I wasn't going to anyway, but... My point is, nobody calls this show. If, if they block Carl or ID, okay, I can... In fact, no. Uh, the way that the phone gates are set up, you won't even get through if you try to block Carl or ID. All I told the dude was that we were going to the west side and I needed more space, and he just fucking flipped. Call me from a payphone if you can find one, fucker. He, like, flipped and just fucking fuck, 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 throwing shit. Well, that's all good. In front of, like, lots of nice older people. It was not good. Well, he did his own... He showed what I've been working with, and he showed everybody what his true colors are. Okay, well, then it sounds like he made his bed and you're walking away. Yeah, pretty I'll be much. at one with, show early, but who cares? But I'm light 150 bucks, which sucks my ball. Because I need the fucking money. No, you don't. I do. <laughs> what you need is a job, or you need to make enough money that one show won't make or break you. Well, no, it's, I'm not broken. Okay, well, then you didn't need the money. But I do need the money. No, you want the money. Oh, Jesus. You're still here. Like, you know, you're not going to die. I wish you'd get caught. Just because one client didn't pay you, Jason. You were pissed about the fucking Ramada. Oh, it wasn't the Ramada. Whatever it was. Oh, and they did fucking pay water me. water park thing. You were pissed, though. I w of course I was pissed. And One, that was how much money? $4,000. Yeah, see, I'm pissed no, about No, I'm sorry, $6,000. That's a lot of money to me. $6,000. It's not a lot of money to you, but it's a lot of money to me. It's not the amount of money. Oh, what are, do you remember? Since you bring that up, do you remember how I fixed that? 
you sent them a letter or something? I didn't send them the letter because they were not paying me. Right. So I stopped that. Oh. Fuck it. We're doing it now. Yeah. <laughs> Think of it this way, Kevin. You now have enough of a following that they follow you to your radio show. Fucking my shit, radio that's pretty show. sweet. Seriously. Which they, really doesn't have anything to do with Albuquerque Comedy, nothing mostly. Nothing at all. We, we normally don't say shit about my shows. Sometimes I'll say that, hey, I'm at the no, last time on Thursday or something, but like that's that it. Like, you, Well, you say that you have a show. but I And mean, then we've had other comedians on the show before in the past, yes, but, but we it's don't never, always have them. It's never been a topic of discussion. No, not really. Not really. I mean, we've talked about it. It, but it's it's never. Let me put it this way. But if there are other people listening that did go to that show, I'm sorry I got kicked out. I'm sorry I used my big fucking mouth. It was my fault. I'd never get kicked out. I have an amazing reputation. I have an impeccable record. So so if you want to hang on me because of that, go ahead. Well, fuck you, because we're in fucking a much better place anyway. So whatever, your people will follow you. The beers will be cheaper. The, you have a couch to sit on at the new place. Yeah. It's bigger. You have former Hoodoo girls working on your table. They don't have any negative reviews as of yet.